right, what is up guys and of course always welcome back to another Wife of Bellion RU tier. This time we're going up against Hannah Panna who is a long time friend of mine and she's always like very very like meta wise really smart so usually my way of dealing with her is trying to <laughs> trying to throw her off her game and uh, oof, oof this looks the path though. Um, so we see both stick away with Ribambi, we see Dreadnought as a potential stealth rocker, we see rapid spin with El Mies. This is this is some high tier stuff. <laughs> this is a very good, very well synergized RU team. Um, I have two things going my way though. Uh, first and foremost, um, the only spinner she has is kind of weak to um, to my uh, to my stick Weber. Um, I do believe my assault vest. Majam do pressure this team somewhat. Ribambi looks to be kind of tough. Um, and actually, if I can pull off a setup here, I think even Balthasar can be kind of a right. This is a scope lens variance, by the way, so it kind of be it's gonna be up there. Uh, now, an easy lead here is to lead off with Lagruth, uh, which is a choice banded flip turn uh, bastard of a Pokemon, as it does pressure her somewhat. I do believe the only Pokemon coming on that naturally is Delmis. And I want to pressure that Pokemon. Now, there's another aspect to reconsider. That is that she's standing on a whale. But <laughs> she's kind of standing on a whale. Um, but basically, if she leads out with Ribambi, um, I think she's going to go for the web, like easy webs. And I'm going to do for the like, easy spin. But I, there's no way I'm going to pull that off naturally. Um, she could also be carrying um, Energy Ball. And that could have actually kind of destroy us so let's see her plan like i said i'm predicting sash goes for stick web so it makes a ton of sense the way i see it there are two options and um, option one is predicting her to bring in delmise that did exactly what i wanted to do it didn't bring her down to sash though but it clearly did a whole lot of damage um but i'm gonna bait i'm gonna bait that delmise and actually just go for a flame forward directly because the way I see it, it's such a great way of her of actually keeping that Pokemon alive. So um, there is no way she would sack this Pokemon as there is no reason to, at least not right now. So Flamethrower, like this is the only play I had in my head and then basically we'll take it from there. Uh, I do believe this Delmise could be a Salt Vest. So we gotta find our way to Rapid Spin somehow. Because I have two Pokemon that absolutely want to preserve there, um, let's see, goes in the roar. That's actually not what I wanted to see. So she would have allowed me to actually um, to spin. That's kind of nasty. Um, I did not participate in that at all. Um, bring in Rota. Um, yes, a head smash could absolutely kill us, but more likely, I think I force her out. And if she goes to Stealth Rock, so be it. I don't believe she will do the Head Smash play, and if she does, then, you know, I'm clearly in trouble. <laughs> Let's see. I'm worried. Liquidation. We take those. Not well, we do take them. Let's see. That's Life Orb, actually. That's kind of scary. That's actually kind of scary. Um... Because mm. it's semi fast, actually. I feel like I need a free switch in somehow. Ooh. Ooh, this is not what I wanted. Now, a Thunderbolt, I'll sack. Ugh, damn it. I don't believe I could have done that smarter uh, besides actually rapid spinning. Ah, it's tough. That's like real tough. The only like, real merit that I have now is that I have Gaius, which clearly can just throw a dynamic punch and then it'll be just about right. Yeah, we'll do that. Bit surprised by Stonish, by the way. Like, Head Smash is one of those monstrous moves that just 
There's so much. But I need to find a way to spin. I really was thinking Del Mise was to play, so I'm clear did my over prediction and uh, got myself in the spot. Not the best situation to be in. Now, she could go for free hits. Liquidation will do a bit more over half, I think, against Machamp. But I think Ribombi and second that probably is smarter. That's something I would do at least. Um, double these. Ooh. Ooh, get the Psychic Surge. That's all right. This time I would punch going to absolutely, I shouldn't say destroy, but um, do a whole lot of damage. Oof. That's a oof from me. Um, I'm saying in Baltasar here, I think that makes more sense not to take any expanding forces on my side. That that is kind of cool, actually. Not not expect that to do so much. Hurt yourself. Hurt yourself. Ah, but we got that right. Um. So right. Um. Want to try to go for a spin here? Because I think I force her out. I hope I force her out. She could bring in Fievel, which would be real annoying because of the psychic. Uh, brings in honey. All right. So that's a sack play. Um, this time I'm actually gonna spin. Please sack it. Don't go to me, don't be that. Let me get the spin away. Ah, oh, this is so rough. This is so rough. I'm like really worried, like that dreadnought clearly was pressuring me and I don't want that to happen again. She does withdraw, goes to Cortez. That sucks. That's the play, like that was the one I was looking for. I really nothing comes in natural against this. But I got something off my sleeve, we'll see what happens. But um Withdraws Cortez, oh she is playing me to roar. <laughs> she is playing me. <laughs> Basically, do I gain anything? Like, I can at least try to see what happens. Liquidation. Alright. I feel I like sack play every time Red Note comes in. Right? Yeah, let's see what the last resort does. Liquidation will do around 50% for sure. Um or even over. Let's see, ooh, I think we do take that, right? Let's see, last resort is gonna be resisted, but you know, at this point, oh, <laughs> I'll take it. All right. Let's try to preserve that and um, don't stone edge, right? Keep liquidation, it's safe. There I go, we're gonna take this one. Not well, but we will take it. And I am... Aqua jitting. Getting a roar out of the way is like the biggest thing that ever happened to us. Um, <laughs> like that's clearly, clearly what we wanted. Um, she could have switched in her indeedy and that would have been tremendously awful for us but we're not there um, and I have no way of actually stopping indeedy naturally 
and like the way she's playing a feel feeble or a rebound or stuff like that comes in naturally and uh, I yet again kind of have to bring in Drapion don't I It's not, it's not a great situation to be at. It really isn't. We, we, sure, we are five for fives, but trust me, I am not a winning position. Let's see, brings in Lisa. That's a Salasal. That's actually not half bad. I don't believe Drape, you want to take more hits than necessary. But at the same time... Well, basically, like, what the Drapion beats here. A few of them, not all of them. I don't have knock on a night slash. I am I'm a man, of course. Earthquake absolutely destroys it. But I also got a really free switch into ball rocks. So we're gonna do that. I think she could go for a toxic. And there would be nothing I necessarily could do about that, but that's my like main play I feel. Yeah, yeah, I should have attacked. I know I should have attacked. Damn it. But at least you can't do anything versus this. So what I'm gonna do now is set in Stoutland, I believe. No, we're setting guys. Of course we're setting guys because I believe Delmise comes in. And we go for the freest knockoff of our life. Which means we bomb this out, which is gonna be great. And I think the psychic train is coming to a close. I wanna try to prevent her from setting that one up. But yeah, we go for knockoff. Getting the assault vest out of the way. It's Colberberry. That's actually way worse. But we still should do a lot of damage. Poltergeist. Ooh, and that's gonna sting. That's gonna absolutely sting. Power. Oof. But we manage. But we manage. Right. <laughs> Either that or one power whip away, I guess. Yep, the awareness is gone. So now we're sending Balrog. Oh, she stays in? Or am I faster? I could be faster. Because I feel Rebound becomes in here. No, no, she is actually okay. Excuse me if I'm a bit surprised here, but that was something I didn't see coming. I'm self rocking them, I'm probably dying here. Yeah, she's faster. Like I said, did not see that one coming. Don't don't get me wrong here, I just didn't feel that was the play. I'm so surprised by it. I'm sorry, but that's... Didn't think she would gonna do that because of the situation I'm in. Or I am in. But, alright. Alright. Good really like the combination of Last Resort and... Uh, or basically, I thought I absolutely killed her, so I was so surprised by that. I'm, I'm still surprised by it. <sighs> I'm over predicting here. I should absolutely attack what is in front of me. Because now I don't get to spin, so I'm clearly in the rough. So just see, sex, honey. And the only like, positive part I have now is versus FIFL, I could potentially get um, the cross shop going. And versus um, Indeedee. Um, 
I don't want it to reset the train though. I really don't. But versus Celestial, I absolutely this time gonna go for an earthquake. Sensi Lisa. Yeah. Fire Blast. Yes, finally I missed. Like soften. Soften to let me off the hook. Soften to just work. Scope lens kicking in. I needed this. I absolutely needed this. It's unfair, but I needed it. Because that fire blast would have done roughly 50%, and then so whether or not I could deal with FIFA. Right now, it looks like Drapion is an absolute threat here. Brings in the double Ds, resetting the terrain. And basically, I need to kind of. No waver back and forth here like do you want to stall this terrain off or not this hyper is gonna hurt me like a lot but I have no real switching either so yeah we're nice slashing um dazzling gleam how much will you do oh it's so much it is so much And the reason I'm not setting up in any way or something like that is because not only am I minus speed, but also have one other crucial thing to keep in mind, and that is that her burning jealousy will burn me if it is the thief I think it is. So I really don't want to get myself into that situation. And when this thief comes in, it's going to get a special defense boost, and uh, you no, know, it could very well. <sighs> like I don't know how how tough this guy will be. We cross shopping at least. I really hope to get something out of this. But Dark Pole, Psychic, and like I said, Burning Jealousy is, I think, the combination of moves it should have. Burning Jealousy should absolutely be in a range for a 2 hit KO. She nasty plots. See, she absolutely goes for it. So, this is scary. Gonna cross Poison, and that will do. Alright. Double the speed. Double the speed is nasty. Like, do I have a way to defeat Delmise after this? Really don't. And how long is that? Info. Terrain. How many turns? Three more turns of terrain. That's. That's not gonna work for me. That's not going to work at all. Do I sack here? I feel I sack. No, no I don't. <laughs> I'm a coward, I know. Please go for dark pulls, something like that, something weird. Please, Dark Pulse, good. Do we take it? No, no. I messed up big time. She got me. She got me. I was so obsessed by the feeling of this Dark Pulse. Because the thing is here, she's probably just Dark Pulse and... I really, really hope then, if that's the case, like I'm leveling here. If this is the case, um... She only has Dark Pulse and uh, Psychic, then maybe I can take that Dark Pulse. 
and I did a mistake actually switching out in the first place. So awkward jetting, um, breaking that because she shouldn't go for another nasty plot. She should just attack. And um, basically, I need to survive this dark pulse somehow with Balthasar. <sighs> I was so convinced it was going to be burning jealousy. Right, so now it's up to this. It's Do I take a Dark Pulse or will I get flinched? All of these thoughts in my head. Come on, Balthasar. Dark Pulse. It's resisted. No, 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 no. She got the sweep on me. Ah, uh, GG, Hannah. Absolutely GG. Like I said, there are two plays that I... I felt was weird, but they also worked in her favor, so, you know, I'm clearly like, I, I won't say she played badly, because that was definitely not it, if anything, I would predict it, and allowed her to break through twice, and I, against a player like her, you don't have the chance to do that, um, but yeah, yeah, knowing she was only like Dark Pulse, probably Psychic, I had an opportunity of probably breaking through, without sacking the whole team so i messed up and she played this one beautifully so for everybody watching thank you for doing just so i hope you enjoyed this game and uh, yeah clearly with that said <laughs> that was a great game thank you so much hannah i really mean that so take care everyone bye